This Ghanaian drumming is one of the school lessons on a day when the experience of fair trade is brought into the classroom. This event today is part of a project called Degon Take or Fair Enough and what we're trying to do is spread the message about the importance of trade justice and raising awareness of how difficult uh, the lives of producers in other countries are. The day starts with a talk from a Ugandan coffee producer. Fair trade has enabled us to earn a minimum price and then it has also increased the inflow of premiums for the farmer to pay back for the hard work and for use of organic uh, manure as opposed to chemical manure and also social premiums for the community pro projects. The pupils attend sessions that combine education with fair trade awareness, including music and art from Ghana. In this science class, pupils learn about some of the properties of one fair trade product, the banana. We have approximately 40 lead schools in Wales who are sharing global learning with networks of local schools. So that's why the primary schools are up here today. This is, this is part of a whole learning process. And it's a learning process supported by Wales's Africa Hub. This event today has come about through the work of Polly Seaton, who is a, a fair trade campaigner, um, and she's received a, a £1,000 grant from the Hub Cymru Africa Grants Pot to promote fair trade through schools. One way is this session, where these Welsh pupils get some idea of how much children in Africa can earn. making paper bags strong enough to hold fair trade goods. Nimrod has been giving us some very straight from the field information, if you like, about the, the life of what a, a coffee farmer looks like in Uganda, the level of hours they're working, the, the distances that they're traveling, and the conditions that their children are in when they go to school, if they get to go to school. Uh, and it's great to have uh, real authentic farmers like Nimrod to come and speak to the children because Nothing spells the message out more clearly than meeting somebody from that country who's had those experiences. Experiences that will help these school children to contribute to a fair trade Wales. My message, my mission, is to preach the message of a fair trade. Trade which is responsible, trade which um, uh, looks back at sustainability, uh, trade which brings partnerships be between producers, we producers and the consumers in the market. Wales is leading in this crusade to transform the world and to ensure that we have a better world where producers' lives uh, uh, improve.